The tropical Andes are a unique fascinating landscape that has been inhabited for more than 12,000 years. Natural resources were used, managed and modified initially by low-impact hunter-gatherer groups and later by sedentary pastoralist agriculturalism communities. The two main ecosystems dominating the Andean landscape are the alpine grasslands, also known as Puno Paramos, at the top of the mountains, and the tropical montane club forests, found immediately below the, the alpine grasslands. These grasslands cover important peatlands and host numerous wetland areas. Despite the long record of human disturbance in this area, the human impact has been more intense over the last decade. The grasslands are now used for intensive cattle grazing, afforestation with exotic species, cultivation and human occupation. The montane club forests are being rapidly deforested for opening new agricultural lands. In addition to the human-induced modifications, climate change is altering the composition and functioning of those ecosystems. The mean annual temperature increased by almost 1 degree Celsius from 1939 to 2004, and projections are estimating increases of 4 to 5.5 degrees Celsius by the end of the century. This increase in temperature is having substantial effects on the hydrological cycle. We are already recording shifts in rainfall patterns and cloud dynamics in the mountains. Cloud dynamics are especially relevant for Andean ecosystems, since these environments are characterized by semi-permanent fog and cloud cover. These changes are favoring the upslope migration of forest species and creating a drier environment that favors the penetration of fires and grasses into the cloud forest areas. This could hamper forest encroachment into the grasslands. In this study, we evaluate the net primary productivity, NPP, of Andean grasslands and compare it with their neighboring cloud forests. We also test whether fire or grazing, the two major disturbances in the grasslands, affect NPP. This is the first study to provide a comprehensive description of the above and below ground productivity of Andean grasslands. The study areas were located in Waikecha Biological Station and Manu National Park in the southeastern Peruvian Andes. We monitored the NPP of grasslands subjected to different disturbance regimes and of two cloud forests every two months and over two years. Our results show that undisturbed grasslands are more productive than disturbed grasslands and that there were no effects of fire or grazing on productivity. We explored the seasonal NPP allocation trends of grasslands and forests and found stronger seasonal trends in grasslands. Most remarkably, there were no differences in above or below ground productivity between the grasslands and the cloud forests. This shows how incredibly productive alpine grasslands are. This may also partially explain why grassland systems are extremely resilient to woody encroachment. Andean grasslands are especially vulnerable to global change and our work highlights the importance of including them in the global carbon budget and in conservation policies aimed at protecting carbon reservoirs. <laughs>